Hey, what's up? This is Miguel from MiguelAngelOnline.com, and I wanted to shoot a quick video just to show you really fast how to add REL equals no follow to your external links. As you can see on the right side here, I have my SEO presser tool, and I'm just finishing up this blog post. And um, one thing I have left to do on here, on my task list here, is please add REL equals no follow to your external links. Now the external link that it's picking up, um, it's, it might be two of them, this uh, Aweber one and also this YouTube video. So I'm going to go ahead and find out, but I'm going to do the YouTube video first and let you see what I do. So I put it to do REL equals no follow and uh, you, have to you have to enter that into the HTML view which is text right here. You find the YouTube URL, which is right here. I see it, and you put it. You, you're supposed to find the exact URL of the YouTube video, which is inside these quotation marks, which is right here. So you want to put your REL equals no follow, just to the right, or just to the side. Yeah, to the right of the quotation marks right here so after the quotations of the link of the external link you press spacebar and then rel equals quotation marks no follow all one word and uh, that's it for that and uh, if you wanted to add a different one, like um, how to make sure that that link, if it was a different kind of link, how to make sure that that link opens up in a new tab, usually you can do that the easy way when uh, just by clicking really fast. Or if you need to do it manually, you do to get the link open to open in a new tab. You do target equals quotation marks underscore blank quotation marks and you can put those together just like how I did it right by uh, side by side as long as there's a space in between and um, I'm gonna go ahead and delete that though that's only if you need to make sure the link opens in a new tab which you do want to do when you have a blog so that your blog stays open and they don't and uh, it counts better for your blog so that is one REL equals no follow that I added. Let me save it. Okay, so I did that one and there's still one more. So it's probably reading this one down here. There it is. It's this Aweber one. I'm just trying to find the end of the link. Here it is. As you can see, I'm going to find a link for you. It's a very long one. This is the link inside the quotation marks. And the way I can tell that it's an external link is because this is my personal blog and my domain is MiguelAngelOnline.com. And this is aweber.com in this URL, so that's why it's an external link. It's because it's, it's a link outside of your site. So that's why you have to put REL equals no follow. So there you have the URL highlighted, and you see the quotation marks just to the right. And then you click to the right of the quotations. You put this cursor there, and then you press space. REL equals no follow and that should do it let's see if it does a trick on the right side and we did it so there you have it that's how you add REL equals no follow uh, target equals blank but mainly tar uh, REL equals no follow hope you got some value out of that see you on the next video